It's day six in the house, and already the housemates are up and getting to go. Well, not before Biscuit pulls Esther up on something he has noticed. <coughs> Why are you screaming my face though? I'm hungry. So are you the only one that's hungry? Yeah. Right, you know. We've got a new guy in the house, Mark. <laughs> my guy. I know Esther's got tingles because I know what's her type. But she will always act up. Esther, let me have a word with you because I know your type. So let's get down to business. I see the way you're acting different because Mark's in the house now, huh? Who told you to ask me that rubbish? What do you mean? Who would have told me anything? So what are you talking about I'm acting different? New cast member, Mark, he's in here. So what and are you, you know he's your type, so what am I going to I'll, talk, talk I'll use my sip and slap you, biscuit. Are you serious? Don't try me today. What are you saying? Nothing, I'm not saying anything. There's nothing to say. Nothing. Go. So you want to stand in my face and lie to me and stuff? Ah, oh, biscuit. Know. No, you know you're going somewhere. Okay, I'm being serious. Well, lie here, you're going somewhere. I'm being serious. You want to lie to me? Okay. <laughs> are you feeling him, yes or no? No, not at all. So how was you smelling his laptop yesterday? <laughs> now nah, just be serious, be real. You're feeling a minute. Like, okay, first, okay, let's just swing this issue. Yeah. You, admitted it, you admitted it yesterday. You just actually. See, this is why I don't like playing games like this. Because oh, always, there's always one honest. biscuit like yourself okay, okay. that will he's always. He's your type, isn't it? I'm not disputing that. You already know that. Okay, so he's your type. So what's the issue with him? There's nothing. There's no issue with him, but never, why? ever. Why? Because he's maybe my type, but he's not my type. Does that make sense? He's my type, but he's not my type. Why is he not your type? Just, he's not my type. Why? You already know he's not my type. Why is he not your type? Who's he fucked that you know? Or has he been through your circle or something that you have an issue? He's fucked bare people. So, so you so, can't put that to the side? Biscuit. Okay, we've been here for, we've been, hold on, we've been here for so long, yeah? And if he's no. told you, sit on my face. You're not going to sit on no, his face. No, no. Why are you chatting shit no, for? No, because it's like, this is what I say to you. That's why we had a conversation mm -hmm. on the debate about mental connection and physical connection. Just because you find someone physically attracted doesn't mean mentally I want, I, I would beat him. That's that I know who you are. Okay. If you want, you will force yourself to have a mental connection. No, there's no mental connection with him, sorry. Are you telling me you can't? You know, like, you know, like a life support. You, you will mm. compromise yourself to do that, yes no, or no? Sorry, what are you sorry. lying for? No. If this, okay, so if you said they want to fuck you now, you're not going to do it? Never. Never, ever, ever. Why and it's because you don't even know. You don't know, that's what I'm saying. I, so, what's he, so, okay, what's he done now? What's no, he done there? Like, you don't know. Like, I don't know what. Like, what for exactly? example, he's boys with my ex. Like, never, ever. He's boys with your ex? Yes. Okay, that one's a bit deep, though. But exactly, still, never. But you're feeling him, though, isn't it? No. You know what's doing me, yeah? Is the fact that I know he's your type. But do you know what? Yes, then? your ex might be watching and thinking, oh, blah, blah, blah. Guy, he's your type, isn't it? No, but I, that's what. I'm why not... are you fighting it? Are You're you... fighting it. You see him every day yeah. in his shorts and his tat, and you're saying, you're not. Okay, have you, have you, have you tweaked a bit? You Never. Because you know, remember, remember when was at the, um, the rate, what, what award show did we go to? I don't know. Which one was it? Um, the African Pride Awards. Mm. You saw Mark Cuban come out of the kitchen. Mm -hmm. You said, oh, I know who's your type, someone like Mark Cuban. And I looked and I said, before I even looked, did I not say never, ever? I don't ever. know that. I don't know And that. then you were like, why? Then obviously I then said, yeah, he's a good looking guy. He's physically my type, mm -hmm. but I'd never get with somebody like that. Mm. And you know it. So don't try I, it. I think he could. I would no, like, just because he's your type. No, yeah, he's my type physically. We're, look where we are. We're deserted. Go on. You, you, There's nothing here. Sinead looks like your type, exotic. <laughs> go, 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 go. Is that what we're doing? What do you go, mean? She's exotic. not my type. She's your type. You she's like exotic type. girls. She's, she's very exotic. No, you're just chatting shit. No, she's she not is. My type. She's she's not my I know type. you. Exotic? What do you mean by exotic? Exotic ain't my type. Like, Sinead ain't my type. You get? Sinead is not my type. She's not my type. She's not my type. Sinead is not my type. Esther, you're stupid for that one, but it's calm. How can you tell me my I type? I know you. How can you tell me my type? Because I've seen your type. Okay, You're cool. Sick. You love body. You love I'm here. <laughs> Let me lift you up like this. You love that. And you're seeing it every day. You're single. Are you, what are you fighting? I'm not single. It's me and God have a relationship. <laughs> <laughs> you don't like, just, bro, if you like him, just say you like him. Really. I don't like just, him. I don't like him. No. You see it on his face, though. Never. His tongue is um, infected. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like you feel him. It is what it is. If you if you you like him, no. A lot of people find people attractive. Mm -hmm. Look at you now. Who just, who said that they will beat you yesterday? But that's different. No, if someone said that they want to beat you, so they find you attractive. Go for it. Listen, go for that's it. That's a whole different level. I'm Let that sit on I'm, your face. I can't go that route. I'm taken. So it's I me too. I told you I'm taken with God. 
Why are you lying like this? Why are you lying like this? I'm just trying to be straight. Why up. are you trying to stare the pot? Listen, and if anything happens, and okay. you tell me, I won't lie. Nothing yet. will ever Hold happen. Hold on, if you nothing say anything, will ever, like, I oh, swear, Hannah, nothing. I don't mind no. Mark, you know. No. Esther, <laughs> I've sat next to you on the sofa. I've seen Mark walk past and do this. I ain't gone like that. When girls do this, <laughs> that is acknowledgement. Like, okay, I can see you. What do you mean? So I can't you itch my hair. What why did I do? Why do you itch it before he walked past? Where's, where, where did yesterday, I itch? What did yesterday, I do? Yesterday, he walked past and, in his shorts and his towel on his shoulder. And what did you I know, do? You're going like that. Huh? You're doing this. What's that? Scratching your wig, you're doing this. What, my you wig knew was, what you were doing. Was my, my wig had an itch. Why didn't it itch before he walked past? It could have itched before. But why didn't it? Why didn't you notice it? I noticed you watching him go past, which no, is calm. I want you to admit. Okay, cool. But what I'm trying to explain to you is, have we disputed that he's not attractive? He's an attractive guy. Okay, he's an attractive guy. Mm -hmm. So naturally, if somebody is attractive. Listen, that you can you can my look at them. My sister Lord, I got your back in it. Well, you ain't got my back because you, you set me up. Back. Listen, you set I got me up, your back. Fucker. I know you your type. Oh, cool. And you're out there, baby. So yeah. just do your thing. Man. I'm not doing my thing. <laughs> so I'm gonna have a little chat with Sinead. Obviously, um, I've kind of noticed a little pattern um, in regards to the image of Sinead in this house. So I'm just gonna have a little word with her and just kind of gather her thoughts on it as well. That's been going on. Do you kind of feel like you've really been associated with sex a lot? Definitely. Yeah. I feel like from the moment I come into the house, I feel like, you know, when you watch something and you've got that character mm. that's supposed to be sexy and stupid and mm -hmm. that airheaded like bimbo, okay. I feel like that's how I was supposed to be portrayed and that's okay. the character. But obviously, I'm just going to come at her and be me. Mm. However, due to things I have done in my past, due to a certain company that I keep, mm. due to how I portray myself, because like I said to you, people can only view me on what I show them. Exactly. I don't show them a lot because mm. I'm a very private person. Mm. And obviously, up until probably now, a lot of people didn't know I have children. Mm. So I feel like even in terms of like, words like escort and all these things get thrown in, paid for sex, that all, whole mm -hmm. thing. They're seeing it like, rah, she's in no, no boot or she's doing this or she's doing that, but what, like, where's her grand, where's her money, where's her coin? Or, and then she goes missing for this time. So I kind of understand, like I said, I've seen it on other people's Instagram pages and you all have that perception. But for me, my difference of why I only show 50% or even 25%, 35% of my life is because obviously I have children. A lot of people yeah, don't but know e that. Even, even, even with all that, that can, go, nah, but I'm that can go for anything. I'm not really even talking about that. That's, that's chit chat, that's lifestyle. You might just not want to talk to them. No, but that's, I'm saying as me, to like, why, okay. like for instance, I felt like, you know, we had a debate and they said about, like everyone said it, when they said the question about, ah, oh, these Instagram models, mm -hmm. um, a lot of them are accused of escorting. Do we think that's the truth? Mm -hmm. I felt like, and a lot of people said that, that was aimed at me. I felt like that. Okay. And I feel like the reason why that question was aimed at me is because I'm in that bracket. You see certain things, but you don't see the explanation of how that came about or mm -hmm. why. And think of it this way as well. Like I said, a lot of people that do escorting on all these things, they will take a picture and post someone and tag it, but you don't see who's there. Like, it just doesn't make sense. Mm. Whereas me, I do the same sort of thing. But the reason why is like, for instance, I could be with my kids walking down the road or whatever, I pass Chanel, I let me get a picture, but they're standing there, but I'm taking a picture. Mm. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. No, so I, the, it's I, the perception. I totally get what you're saying, but literally when I kicked off the question, that escorting thing had nothing to do with it. Ah, okay, I'm talking cool. about foundation. I'm talking about, that's why I said, uh, uh, it's you associated with sex. Escorting is a is a element or you get okay, what I yeah, mean yeah, like yeah, but yeah, obviously yeah. is a been a, a yeah. pop major because, thing so maybe yeah, that's why you're bringing it up. Yeah, it up and associated with me. There you go. Do you get but what I'm before, saying? Before it even reaches to the that, escorting, you're it starts off from somewhere else, and yeah. that's what I'm trying to say. Yes. The whole sexualization. When I first saw Sinead, I was like, yeah, this girl looks cool. I thought I recognised her from somewhere. She said she done modelling, so I was like, yeah, that's probably it. And I just thought, let's see how things go because someone whispered to me about. Uh, saying something like when she drinks, she gets wild and all that. So I was like, yo, this one might be a beefy one in the house. Like, I feel like not so much today and now because okay. people have gotten to know me and obviously they see like, right, it's not that. Or some people might even still think that, I don't know. Mm. But I feel like when I came into the house, I pretty much got the perception that that was the role that they had in my head that I was okay. going to be playing. Okay. I felt like I was very much bikini, I'm not going to get my hair wet, I'm going to be lotioning, mm. that kind of <laughs> bougie type. You know, yeah. that type of thing. Do you get what I'm saying? And, how, and what's your perspective? Because obviously Even like someone made a, like, I think I was talking to Nunu the other day, or someone, don't quote me on that, I was talking to someone, another female, and I said, Ra, like, are you doing a sexy thing or whatever? And they referenced like, no, my body ain't like that, or I'm not like, you're doing that, like, I'm not really. And I'm thinking like, uh, Ra, everyone okay. here to me has a banging body in their mm. own way. Mm. You're, everyone's gonna find someone attractive or ugly. It's your own perception. Mm. But I'm thinking like, Ra, what's the difference between me doing the shower sexy, mm. I'm on Baywatch, and you doing it? So again that brought up the same thing do you get yeah, what i'm saying yeah, i feel you i feel you i feel you and how do you feel about that 
How does I'm that used make to you it. It don't make me feel no way. To be fair, it's disappointing because mm. obviously I would not like to be viewed that way. However, I have to hold my hands up and have responsible as to what I've done mm -hmm. to give people that even idea iota to even mm -hmm. perceive mm -hmm. me that way. So mm -hmm. I will hold my truth and I'll own that because certain things I have partaked in and done, whether it be present or past, mm -hmm. it has been like, for instance, obviously I've done glamour modelling, I've done, so I get it. Mm -hmm. But I'm just saying, obviously, when I came into the house, it was kind of like straight away Barbie doll. Like, do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's not nice, but at the same time, like I understand. But moving forward, I feel like I've built up this shield now, so it doesn't affect me. I'm cool like that. Mm -hmm. But yeah. I feel like if I wasn't at the point where I was with myself, mm. comfortable wise and whatever, I probably would be crying and uh, do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. But I understand, it's me understanding, but obviously hopefully I've proved to everyone that it's, I might have sexual aspects of me mm. no more than you do as mm. far as I'm concerned, because mm. I've got to know you. Mm. But in regards to even some of the guys, in regards mm. to like some of the tasks and stuff and the questions that I've been asked and stuff mm. like that, I do feel that coming into the house and up until maybe this point, I have been very sexualized in this house, but we'll see what happens, innit? Yeah. It's awesome. starting to rain, so to be honest with you, I want to kind of keep this right, step cool. in. Right. But yeah. yeah <laughs> Some of the housemates are not in the mood. They seem to be distraught by the lack of food in the house. Oh not to God. worry, our next task should fix this. Well, if you like what's on the menu. So today's task is called Here's Some Food For Ya. As you can see, I've got two bowls in front of me with loads of food for you guys. Since there's two bowls, it means you guys need to be in two teams. So we've already chosen the team captains for you and they are Atelia and Sinead. Can I get you to come over here, please? So as the team captain, it's up to you how you want to complete this task. So basically what you have to do is Finish the food in this bowl as a team as fast as you can. The way that you're going to do that is up to you. So if you decide as a team captain that you want to eat the food by yourself because you think you can do it fast, it's up to you. But if you feel like you need your teammates' help, they're welcome to help in as well. However, you have to make sure that only one person at a time is at the table eating. So the fastest team to do so wins the task today. The losing team, unfortunately, will have to pick two boys and two girls from their team to eliminate from the debate tonight. But also, the losing team, the four people chosen from the losing team, will have to do a pretty nasty task tonight. Is that clear? Sinead, do you go first? Adrian. Mark. Reva. Carnage. Shoma. Go, go. Biscuit. Be money. Esther. Nunu. Honey. <laughs> Fuck you then. I oh, I didn't see you. See that energy is real. I didn't see Keep him. Keep that same energy, man. Right. Keep that same energy when you do pick me. I didn't see him. Okay, can I get the two team captains seated at the table, please? Just to go over the rules quickly, only one person can be seated at the table at, the t at a time. It's up to you when and when you want to change things around. When I say go, Sorry. you can I've open. I've seen if I could open it in my nails. One, two, three, go. Oh. Wow. Oh. oh my God, oh my God. We all know I'm Muslim. We all know I don't eat pork and yet there's sausages in the bowl. Am I going to be the one that's going to ruin the team? Am I going to be the one that's going to say, I can't do this and forfeit for the team? Listen, I don't think so. We're still going to win this. Yo, this, what I'm seeing in the bowl, I know, I know, we're not winning. We're not winning. I can feel that we're not winning. Ah, oh, article. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, no, that's fucked. Oh. I can't even lie. If you need help, tag man in, you know. Eat what's in your hand, babe. So... Is that ketchup? <laughs> it's not dry. Is it ketchup? Chili sauce. Yo, I let's don't go, even let's, know. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, come on, come on. 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 Oh, I'm gonna finish this, yeah? Right. Come on, Tilly, come on! Hey, right, tag, tag someone in. Put that one in your mouth and then tag someone in. Tag someone in! Tag, tag someone, someone in! in. No, oh, no, 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 no. Honey, eat what's in your hand. You know what? I think she's actually just hungry, so she's choking. <laughs> <laughs> she's just munching. Come on. Man. I don't know why this girl doesn't want to get up. <laughs> she's clearly hungry, and I don't blame her. The food's been a bit tight in the villa recently, but. 
Tilly moving silly. Maybe it's because the sausage looked like Willy. And, you know, she used to be angry at men back in the day. So maybe she's just imagining biting, you know, chew, chew the dick off of these men that I hate so much. So I just, yeah, because I hate men. I just... You can come back for rounds for seconds, man. You can come back there. It's a buffet. Let's go. Carnage, destroy it. Deep throat, let's go. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. Done. Yeah. 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 Carnage. You see you, yeah? You've come here to cause carnage. How are you gonna deep throat like that, bro? <laughs> That's mad. Carnage walked into this place like a fucking bomb, yeah? He came in and told every man in there he'd fuck all of us at the same time. And now you can't handle five sausages, bruv. You can't handle one, two sausages, bruv. Back your talk, Kaz. Come on, that's dick Shut right there. Up. Come on, Esther. That's dick right there. That is dick. Shut up, why are you making him laugh? Just try to show him right now. Don't mind him. Come on, you can do this. Esther, come on, yes. Make up with yourself, make up yes. with yourself. Yes. Esther, you're like a, you like a hoe. Fuck you, fuck you. Come on. Yes, Esther, yes, come yes, on. Eat what's in your hand and tap someone out. Ah, that day. Oh, Jen Masda. Salobwa. Salobwa. Go next. You go next. Well done. Well done, Esther. That was so good. Come on, listen. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. It's nice. It's nice. It's nice. It's nice. It's calm. You like food. It's nice. You always eat everyone's food everywhere. Eat it. It's nice. <laughs> Come on, Shaima. You're doing well. Yeah, Come, on. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Mark, pretend it's my crunchy nut. You see, it's difficult living with Chilma. Like, I walk past her and she's tasting something. She will never focus on her own plate. She's always tasting other people's food. Eat, man. Go, yes, Shoma. Well done. Well done. Go, 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 go. Hey! Leave the bread. Leave the bread. Let's get started. Do the chips in it. So nobody wants to judge the bread. It's fine. Leave that to the end. Yes, yes. Are you trying to get Good thing people are hungry, though. Okay. Get in there. Tap him out. Tap him out. Go, go. Come on, Adrian. We can do it. Let's go. Let's go. Teamwork. Yes, go, come on, let's go, yes. Them lot are just leaving bad things on their plate. Good, come on. Hurry up, man. Yes, Adrian, you're doing well. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Hurry up. Crisp and bread, I mean, crisp and sausage. Come on, go, go. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, go, go. Just fill, fill up your mouth, fill up your mouth. Just bite it, just bite it, just bite it, just bite it. Just bite it, you're wasting time, bite it. No, 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 it's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, I'm waiting to go back. I'm waiting to go back. Yes, come on, Reva. Let's go. Let's go. You're doing well. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, Luki. Come on, Luki. Yeah. Is it what sauce is then? Come on, Reva. I know what it is. It's not relaxed. I feel like I'm going to do it. Fill up, 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 Let's go. Come on. We've already won. Let's go, Reba. Take your time, baby. Let's go, Reba. 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 Let's go, Sausage and chips, please, well, biscuit. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Get out of here. Stop, stop looking at <laughs> our You got bear on your plate. Don't worry about that. I said that. Yeah. Is that it? Oh, you oh, ain't too big. You don't want to make cheese for us. It's not that big cheese. I'm not just saying. All right, come out, come out, come out.
Congratulations to you guys. Yeah. What is going on, my friends? I just risked my whole religion for this sausage. Okay, although I didn't eat the sausages, everyone else touched the sausage. And I risked everything for the team to lose. Like, are we serious right now? Are we really going to take this? Oh my God. Sinead, your team will now have to decide which four members of your team are not going through to the debate. You're what? You're the right person. You know oh, no. your energy was within me. You got God in you. That's what I'm saying. Nunu, you're stopping. Sinead, can I know your decision, please? Yeah, um, Honey and I are not partaking in the debate tonight. And Mel? And the Mel's. There's only two, There's only two of them. All so. right, so can you guys prepare yourself for the task that you'll be doing tonight? The rest oh. of you, ah. please Welcome get ready for your debate. Honey <laughs> and Lucas are tidying up the kitchen. They seem to be having an absolute blast doing it. <laughs> this place is a mess, isn't it? It's disgusting. It's not a mess, it's disgusting. <laughs> a mess is like when you leave something like where it's not supposed to be, but this is disgusting. I'm not touching this with my hand, it's disgusting. Come on. There we go, thank you. Uh. So, honey, G. Lucas. <laughs> Why are you back? Why are you here? What's your, what's your purpose? What's your... You hurt a lot of people, you upset a lot of people. Um, wow. <laughs> not sure you understand why. Understand or how. why or what? Why for what? As in, I don't, I'm not sure you understand how you hurt people, should I say. Because when I just said that, you said, hmm. I'm really feeling annoyed right now because, I mean, this question keeps popping up from left, right and centre. You know, Nunu's come this way, the other one's come the other way. And now, Lucas, really, please, like, I've just come. Let it be a couple of days. Let me breathe. Let me, you know, put my head down, settle in a little bit. And then we can go on about the questions. I'm tired already, man. Like, right now, it's just, I'm just, I can't be bothered. You offended a few people. You said certain things, obviously. I know you said something about, you know, you was being managed or something like that. I remember your manager was someone that pissed me off as well at that time. Yeah. Um, and I always felt like <clears throat> as much as, you know, you're quite eccentric and whatever in how you express yourself or whatever, like I always felt like I always gave you a sort of a time of day. Do you get what I'm saying? And when, and you more than anyone know how we are in back chat because we started together. Yeah. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, we had a proper family dynamic. As much as we was crazy on set about our views and our, you know, core values and whatnot, we're all from different environments. You're a Newcastle lass, do you know what I'm saying? So it was, you know, we all have our views, but it was almost like, you forgot all of that 
And then as soon as you had the opportunity to attack us, you attacked it. Us, the cast members, you attacked it. The, the company, uh, backchat the brand, you know, you came out Andy, like, it almost felt like as if, rah, like, no matter how much, you know, you felt that we might have offended you, like, it was never that, like, to that extent. So, you know, to, to, to hear things come out, like, as much as it's, it's great for the show and, you know, all them things there, it's like, a lot of people have been hurt. Do you get what I'm saying? And I don't mm. think you, you know, grasp the extent of how her. It's not that I don't that. grasp it. Just because I don't talk about it doesn't mean that I don't know. The one thing you have to understand, Lucas, is that people change. Yeah, of course, of course. And it's been change. two years since I've been on this show. It's been two years since I've contacted anyone of mm. you guys. It's mm. been two years since I've spoken to any of you. Mm. Um, I've been through a hell of a lot of shit in the past two years. As we all have. Yeah, of course. Um, I can't speak for other people's actions, but obviously for my own, like, I know the situation I was in mm -hmm. and the situation that I'm not going to come and clear his name and speak on his actions, but that's his business. Whatever and he's his done... His actions were a direct result of what you said to him. What it's you, not, it, not, it's not, not what I've said. He's come and approached me to come to work with him, for him to manage me. And then I find out later on that he's got some sort of a grudge against Andy and he's trying to fuel the whole situation with that, which is why I took a step back, OK? But because, fair enough, what's that? Okay, fair enough... No, hold on, hold on, hold on let me finish. You've you asked me, Go OK, so let me finish. OK, fair enough, I attacked Andy myself. Fair enough, I, I, I attacked Bakcha. Fair enough, I did what I did with Choma Esther. But that's me and what happened with me that I'm bringing out. Him, what he's Can done, hold on, sorry, was sorry. him I'll attacking I'm just Andy. Say something. That's nothing to do with my side. Right. I've, I've done it because of you how placed, hurt I was. You detached He's just come as, as a person, just a random person, Honey. and just ruined whatever he's ruined. You, that's you, nothing to do with me. You he's allowed stand him up to for his own actions. Do you, do you, and that, that's fine. But what about your actions? The second thing is responsibility for your actions, because your actions are a direct correlation to how it gets blown up. Without you, there's nothing to blow up. That's why people will have the issue with you, because remember, we don't know him. At the reunion, I promise you, if my man was there, I would have stuck it all over him. As much as we can go at each other on, sh on, the, on the camera and be like, yeah, shut up, you're chatting shit, rare, rare, rare. That's, what, that's us doing our jobs. That's how we feel defending our views, our values, our cause, do you know what I'm saying to you? Bulliness was never a part of the show. Do you get what I'm saying to you? It was never something that it the show... It was never part of it, Hold on, hold on, hold on. You let me finish. You cannot blame someone finish, for you know? feeling that way. Of course not. It's almost like you were saying and making things that weren't there. Like you said, I, I remember hearing stuff to do with like racism, like we're racist towards you because we're black. I already and... said that in the second episode anyway. I already mean? said in there that I felt like you guys were being racist. I already said but, that from toe before the reunion, before the anything. If you felt like so you were being racist... you can't even bring that in right now, Lucas. I can. That's invalid because you already knew. You already knew. It's not like it's new knowledge. I'm not going to lie to you. already knew. I already said it. This is what you do. Calm down. Me and you having a conversation. I, I, I don't understand this, lady. Like, ladies and gentlemen, I don't, I don't, I don't get this. Like, you, you, I'm asking you the question to get answers because you said things. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, I get you're frustrated, but like, it's cheeky, isn't it? Like, come on, like, I'm not even having a go at you here. I'm just letting you know, like, you upset us, same way you feel upset. Like, in the heat of the moment, there's so many things you said. We're not going to pick up on everything that you say. We all say things when we're angry. Now. A lot of the time, you say a lot of things, and we're like, okay, cool, it's just honey. Do you get what I'm saying to you? When it now comes back from the outside, it's like, whoa, so what, is this real? That's how you really feel? To me, it's not a race thing. It's never been a race thing. It's, okay, cool, you're a certain type of way, fair enough. But at the same time, that doesn't mean we have to stand for it. We're all very strong characters. And at the end of the day, that's what the show's about. Like, put your best foot forward first, put your, the, the, the foot that you want to put forward first. Do you get what I'm saying to you? Chioma and Esther are having a calm conversation by the poolside, away from everyone else. And one thing I can't stand that she keeps doing consistently is the lack of, um, t um, of ownership. Ownership, thank like, you. The lack of ownership, like, she keeps passing the blame on to somebody else. I'm not going to lie to you, Choma. If she come in, and I said this, year, if she'd come in and said, you know what, Esther, Choma, can I speak to you, please? Or even privately, Esther, can I speak to you in private? Choma, can I speak to you in private? Cool. 
what's the problem? Oh, uh, Esther, I know me and you have got a lot of history. I know how it went down. You know, I know I made some horrible comments. Uh, I wasn't forced, do you know what I'm saying? But I said it, I do regret it, and I'm going to apologise, and how can we move forward? Now, that's taking positive steps to building something new. Whereas when you come in and say, it was some, it was him, him, her, 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 he, he, ha, ha, ha. Yeah, I mean, you expect, You're making, yeah, it's just you expect like... expect everyone to just forgive you. Like, I'm, I don't even want to, like, come across as bitter or something, but obviously she's put me in, like, you know, in a very, yeah. like, bad position, position and yeah. it's, it ruined my market at a point, do you know what I mean? Yeah. And it's like... It's all right. After everything you've done, she's come in here expecting all of us to be her friends, mm -hmm. and then you can't like apologize. You can't yeah. sit me down in the corner and say, "Oh, do I'm sorry for saying this." Especially because you two were so and close. Exactly, like you I used took to her defend in. Her. Do you know you what I mean? To, like even I. Right, let's just say people might have said, "Oh, Esther, you were a bit mean to her." Like, do you get what I'm saying? You you took it to a certain level. Maybe you wasn't as open. Trauma. I gotta say, you rid for that girl. That was your dog. Like you, you lot used to go shisha. Yeah. Do you get what I'm saying? You lot used to go out together, get food together, come back together. So, if anything, if she ain't got loyalties towards me, which is fair enough because we weren't friends like that, yeah, we, we worked together, we cohabitated, she should have still had some form of loyalty towards you. Mm. I've swear she mentioned suicide, yeah. like she felt suicidal. I'm not trying to show no lack of sympathy towards her, but we've all been at points in our life where we've been suicidal. When we first started the show and the kind of backlash we got, yeah. I felt so sad. I felt like, right, what have I done? Like, do you know what I mean? I mean, raw. Right, why do these people hate me? People are calling me bullies. People are calling me so so many different names, so many different things because of her. People were signing your DMs, talking to you like, say you was a hoe. Yeah. Like, you don't know how that made you feel. Take responsibility, take ownership for what you've done, apologise, and then we can move on. That but apology is so important. It's actually so important to me. Like, mm -hmm. sit me down, talk to me, yeah. have a conversation, apologise, own that you were wrong, do you know what I mean? And, and then we can move on from that. If like, someone calls me at four o'clock in the morning, I don't fuck with these girls, I don't fuck with you. Uh, tell me something about Esther. Esther's a bitch. As rise up herself, trauma's a bitch. That, that I would even accept that. You called me a bitch and kept it moving. You speak about, you know, I'm looking for a father for my daughter. You speak about, uh, you slept about. I don't even remember what she said about Azra. She's so not. she's come here for a reason. Mm -hmm. She's come here for girls? a reason. Yeah, you're right. She's just, I feel like she's here to play a game. She's being fake. She said that she has a right, just like everybody else, to be here. No, she doesn't. That right was revoked when you said Backchat was shit. That right was revoked when you said we didn't mean shit to you. And when you Backchat, don't want to be with those, these yeah, people, but you came I, into a whole that, house with them. Yeah, that right was revoked when you made racial allegations that we were racist towards you. Mm. That right was revoked when you went, you went even to try to take legal action to sue Backchat for defamation of character. That you said that we embarrassed you, we made you feel like shit. You don't have the rights to be here. We can both play fake. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. I walked in, Esther went into her room, collected her stuff and upstairs. When she went into the room, I went into after her and I said, can we talk? She said, no, not now. Mm -hmm. Okay? No, not now means no, not now. Right? Was... So hold on, hold on. Okay. So I step out the room, right? I've already wow. explained this before. You're not listening, honey. I've already explained that it wasn't a conversation, that I was being... We already okay, filmed and that's, this and that's what I'm saying. So I don't know why you guys are bringing this back Listen up again. To I've already talked about this Let me explain it to you. Ago. What I'm saying is, if some, when you come into a house... Okay, cool. Deeper like this, honey. You've come into the house. We haven't seen you in two years. You get it, yeah? We haven't seen you in two years. Yeah, so, yes, time is a healer. Yeah? We're all grown adults. Get it. Fantastic. Understand that. As you can clearly see, people are... Some people are still in their feelings to an extent, but you can see like yourself, you're still in your feelings to an extent, but we've all grown. Now, yes, when you come in, Esther is well within our rights to say, you know what, I can't share, because these are living spaces. I can't share a room with honey. That's cool, move your stuff, That's fair fine. enough. Oh, I want to talk to you right, not right now. Fair I was up to Choma, I was up to Esther, and I was up as Raya. Everything was cool. As far as I'm concerned, Esther said on the text message, we're cool, we're all right, but I just don't want to talk to you anymore. You, you, and then that's it, and, and, and we did and, and, and it. That's if you message Esther, oh, Right, cool. I apologize. Why are you making but it look like as if I actually sat there and spoke to I don't someone care about if you, them? Listen, I don't care. But if that's you, how you're making it look. I don't like care. It. I don't care. What I care about is your true intention. Whether you sat there and devised the plan, whether you sat there and it just naturally happened. You think I've got to stand on my hand to devise a plan? Uh, honey, you you're a very calculated girl. Speak, I don't know. Speak. I'm not saying that you did. I don't know. What I do know is. You are somebody that generally, from how I've known you to be, you generally give a shit. You generally care. As much as you're very strong and you know your own, you care. Then Irrespective should of I tell you if the, it was Should I tell me? you the truth why I haven't spoken to them? Mm -hmm. Because I've got anxiety, okay? okay. okay. Because I've suffered from depression and anxiety for the past two years. 
Every time I see my darling, I start, if I tell you what I've been through in the last two years, I, trauma, I get anxiety. I want to go speak to them, but I get anxiety. Do you understand? Why? Why do you get anxiety? Is I it because your anxiety? Yeah, I just get anxious. And I understand. So what do you, you know want what? Me to do? Okay, do you know what I want what you to do? do, honey? do? I want you know what to come to you. No, listen, listen. Okay, I'm listening. I'm happy that you spoke to me now because I wanted to come to you and mm -hmm. say, look, how can I speak to Choma and Esther? And what kind of way can I do? Because I need the same way you No, listen, listen. Because you don't understand, Lucas. You don't understand. I want. I wanted to ask you. What best way should I go around it? Because in my head, there's just so much going on. And then when I want to talk about it, I get anxious. Do you understand? I get anxiety. Do you get that? Do, do so you, it's not as easy. Do you know what I'm going to do? Say. It's I, easy I, of to course, say it's, it. it's easy to say. Easier said than done. Get, get granted. <sighs> you're here for a reason. Like, mend the bridges. You're telling me about you went through this, you went through that. I understand, honey. We all are going through these things. But again, take responsibility and accountability for what you have done. Esther's been through it. Chioma's been through it. People have all gone through these things. And yes, you have anxiety and I understand that. And it might not be as simple as putting your foot forward and going to say, oh guys, let me chat to you, rare, rare, rare. But again, you have a personality that is very big. You have a bold nature. You don't let nobody take you for a ride. I've sat at home, I've wrote a letter to Chioma's family apologising if they've heard of what I've said about their daughter. What do you want me to do? And it's like, I have I, to and, take and baby what, steps, baby steps for everything, Lucas. It's mm -hmm. taken time, I get it, but it will get done. But, but what do you want me to do? You took a big step coming on this show. So that same way you took that big step coming on this show is the same way you take that big step going and meeting these people and you say, you know what, Esther, I know you have an opinion, I know you feel a certain type of way. Come here, girl, let's talk. <laughs> nah, but for real, man, listen, chat to them, man. Because at the end of the day, like, I will defend you, I will defend any of these cast members, even the new people. Like, because we're, we work together. It's like when you go to work, you defend your colleagues. Do you get what I'm saying to you? Like, we, 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 this is us. Do you get what I'm saying? We, especially more you more than anyone. We started this shit. But I get you, I get you. If, 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 if at any point you feel you need my help in any way, let me know. And then we can have a chat. If you need me there even, let me know. Because one thing I don't want from this is, anything else like that to repeat itself yeah, because yeah. that would be unforgivable. Love, man. Thank you. Give the girl a break, man. Like, it's not that deep. What? She's misunderstood, man. What? Like, Mark, you see this thing? Maybe you need to wash out your face. Yeah, yeah, that's the thing. That's what she's trying to convey. That's what she wants that's people to think. I definitely me, do feel I, like honey's calculated. Know, it's, maybe it's where she's from because like, from what I've seen, what the hell have you seen? Okay, so wait, you uh, the only thing I thought was outrageous was the Drake okay. comment. Okay. Let me not lie. And that made me think, okay, she's a bit of a chat shit. So you think I'm being mean to her? In this house? Listen, you saw the look when she was asking for food, the look you gave her. But she gave her food. Yeah. She didn't have to cook for her. Bearing in mind, we had already, you know, we're, we're rationing food here already. She, that's an extra mouth we had to feed that when we didn't I'm know about. When I'm around I'll say she cool. Is, Is it, it more of the case that you're being rationable and you're being nice and whatever because you're scared that she's gonna go and say and chat more no, shit? No, no, I don't. Listen, there's nothing that that girl can't say. The girl has said the worst well, of the she worst. Said she's Drake's baby. Do you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Esther, two years ago in 2016, I would have been a, a mean girl. 100%. I would have been a very, very big, I would have been the biggest bitch in this house. If people would have been irritated by me. But now I'm, I'm growing. As, as with age comes growth, with age comes knowledge, with age comes wisdom. I'm learning how to tolerate people. Even if I don't like you, I should still be able to tolerate. You go to work, you work with people you don't like, exactly. but you tolerate each other because you want to get paid, right? So this is what I'm doing. I'm tolerating her. I just I'm sorry, man. I feel you're like chatting shit. Okay, go on. I feel you're chatting shit. Okay, like, so what do you feel? I just think, okay, cool, if the girl's done something, then what? Move to her, innit? If it's that much of a... No, but we don't want to move to her. Why not? And you know what? The funny Look thing is... You snapped at Adrian, you should have laced her. I didn't even snap at Adrian. You should have laced her. You, you think someone could talk shit about me? I'll... Look, lace, meaning you should have done the Mark. do. Mark. And what is done the do? Mark. We were someone very... Is chatting. Mark, Let me listen. Tell you hold no, on, listen. Hold on. It's been two years. It's been two years. It's been two years. When we first heard it, Ox Andy, he was holding us in the changing room. We were going to... You understand? We were that upset. You reunion, have you? That's the difference. How bad? of people will we be if we now go and lace her or do her or do 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 and do what you say ga ga mm. <laughs> no but you understand what i'm saying though no so what would you do me so you no, still expect us to no. go and grab her by the neck <laughs> and really yeah. but you know what you're forgetting um, mark you're coming from a male perspective women deal with things differently women deal with things differently but at the same time look, we're not violent people times are healing i'm not a violent well. person i just do what i have to do with and the simple situation is this there's nobody that can go around Fucking up my name, chatting yeah, the most shit she's chatting, mm. and then still be present. Let me tell you it doesn't matter if it's 15 years from now, okay. 10 years from exactly. now. The anger I you mean, had there. The difference is. I think we're in different she, no, places. No, hold on. No, the, the, yeah, the, first of all, we're in different places. The difference is also, she said what she said. 
I would have probably laced her. Trauma was going to do her. Is, Trauma was going to fight her. If she hadn't come to the reunion, she listen, was gonna fight her, if she hadn't come to the reunion and at least attempted to rectify it. Me bonding with you guys, as soon as she came in and I saw the reaction, I was a bit like, I just looked for something to want to hate about her. So I was like, ah, look at her shoe. <laughs> yeah, he did. He said, he said to me, I'm like, look he, at said, shoe. he tried to make me feel better. I said, look at the shoe. Look at the shoe. Look at the shoe. Look at the shoe. But what I'm trying to say is because <laughs> automatically I felt your anger in it. Mm. And for me, that goes a long way. So what bothers me most is I overheard that. Well, obviously, when we were chatting in the house, her excuse was the lamest excuse I ever heard. Mm. I don't know her, so I can't judge her. I go on what I hear and I try to be fair. And do you know what I'm saying? What I heard was that she supposedly vented to her boyfriend or whoever it was, yeah. and he was the one that was like, that's because bullshit. Yeah. That's what we said. I, I as a man, if, I was, if you were my girl and you had a problem with someone in the house, yeah, and then you came to vent to me. Do you think I'm going to be doing keyboard warrior? Yes, tell me more. I'm going to say this and that. No, even that, you recorded. Nah, bullshit. It didn't happen. Of course it didn't happen. It didn't happen. She didn't and, even know the person the in there. What I've noticed about this house, yeah, is that everybody's on this tippy-toe shit. Yeah? Are you like, mad? Everybody's on this tippy-toe Who's shit. Who's on tippy-toe shit? I can, I can, what I mean by tippy-toe shit? You know, what, tippy -toe you know what, what I was saying this morning mm. with regards to you can't act tough in this house. I mean, do you know what I mean? A face. lot of the people who are who are bitches, who I you know might be bitches, whatever. You you can't way. come out. Who are you we're talking, talking to? I will come to your party. bed and say. So what were you really saying? Came. Well, the first day she came out here, she was talking about me on her channel, saying, Ah, I don't know why Esther well, left the room. She's that, vlogging, wait, wait, vlogging, that vlogging. vlogging. I don't you know. Don't know. But she was just like, I think it's recorded for the future. Uh, I don't know why Esther left the room. No. What the fuck do you mean you don't know why you le I left the fucking room? You see that? You see that? You just told me right there. Yeah. The fact that she was doing that, she's got a plan. Thank you, thank you. You see that? She's got a plan. Not, so for me not. personally speaking, me, I'll take her phone, I'll break it. I'm just going to be real. <laughs> I know. But it's up to you. She's smiling, you. smiling in your face, but when she's doing all of that, because it looks all good in the camera, yeah. but let's be real, when it gets out to the real world, you're not going to get what she's dragged doing. Again, again, as always, it's always that we're bullying, we're like team tagging no, by the biggest mind. bullies. Let's take the tagging and bullying, I don't mind. If she wants to call me a bully, then I'm a bully. Do you get what I'm saying? I don't know what's in the air tonight, but it seems like everyone in the house is in their feelings. Nunu has a confession to make to Be Money. I just feel like when we done that new activity yesterday mm. about who's the one person you'll fuck. That was two days ago. Okay, two days ago. I, I said you. Mm. I feel like you've been moving a bit weird around me ever since. How? You've been trying to avoid me. How? Literally, like when I, when I approached you, you said you want a restraining order on me. You just skipped better episodes. I went to the season finale. <laughs> I felt some, some sort of energy between us. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. <laughs> huh? What? All right, cool. What kind of energy do you feel? What? Solar energy? Um, uh, wind like, energy? I just felt like... <laughs> Electric? What did you feel? Okay, but why can't you just be a big man? So how do you think I should handle a, it? A, a man will keep it real, keep it 100. And why have I kept it 50? 20, 25? Yeah, you haven't been real. Yeah, I think your problem is, I think, like you said, you told me that you're used to, like, this ain't normal. You get, you get man, there's 100 man on you. 100%. And well, and that's cool. I never chase, you, I never chase and I think, And I think the problem is obviously... So easily accessible. That's fine. So you, how come you haven't easily accessed it? Because this is in a house, like, okay, so there's only six, how many guys here? There so was only three that met the, met the expectation, yeah. and I put it down to one. This is an unnatural environment. When I land f back in London, Dick is waiting for me. I think the problem you have is not anything I've done. I think the problem is you have is that you've been rejected. It's not about who it's from. Rejected? Yeah, that's wow. how you feel you've been rejected, because I'm not giving you what you want. No, I'm not, because at the end of the day, I think it's mutual. Yeah. It's not me wanting you. You want to have fun? I want to have fun. Shut the fuck up. Get to the room. I don't want to have fun with you. OK. I, I, I've said that okay, to you. But you didn't. I did. No, you didn't, because you told me to suck your dick. <laughs> <laughs> I told you, you can suck my dick if you like, but I ain't trying to smash. And you said I don't do that without anything in return. I said, absolutely, 100%. So I kept so it So it's a one-way stream. You just want to get pleasured, and that's that. You're offering me something. I don't know what you want. But I said, but you know, if you want to do something, you can. And you said, no, you don't want to. So why are we? That's I think I had like a real G. I said, yo, I don't want to smash. But if you want to give me, if you want to give me, uck, you, you feel free. I'm not a queen. You, I, I don't do that. You know what I mean? There you go. It's so, reciprocal. You certainly not. So. <laughs> 
Are you in your period? I will listen to this though. Let's keep it real, yeah. Do you remember why we fell out? No, not really. Oh, you don't remember why we fell out? I want you to think back to why we fell out. I don't want you to tell me why we fell out. Because you kept saying I like white white penis. That's and not I don't. that's not the real reason why we fell out, Nunu. Be real. Why what I happened? I can't remember. A lot of commenters, a lot of viewers kept saying that they thought that I was like sexually attracted to you and they thought I wanted to sleep with you because I said I wanted to know what you were like in bed. They didn't understand that I meant I wanted someone to tell me what they'd done and see what you were like in bed. Not that I wanted to experience it myself. So anyway, I was trying to defend myself and went on Twitter and I said, I think Nunu is beautiful, but I would not sleep with her because I, the way she moves, remember I did it? The way she moves her shoulders, I just don't think she's... Good you know, in bed. Like, yeah, I don't think she's got it. She talks a good game, but I don't think she can back it up. One of your fellow Twitter girls, who's quite popular and has some clout on there, was like, you know, Nunu can do better than you, and it turned into a of thing... Of course I can. All right, cool. And it turned into a thing about me, apparently, I said you're unattractive, which I didn't. But the point is, I said I wouldn't sleep with you, and you went on Twitter and made a big, big statement and said, I would never you I ever wouldn't. want to sleep with someone like you. So why are we here now having this discussion about why I don't want to smash? I don't even... And I remember, don't... you didn't even go on the Reese's show because I said I don't want to smash. I don't believe me, you fell out because of sex. That, are you, you mad? It's deeper than that. It's not about sex, it's about me not wanting to have sex with you. Here we are again. What? That's a bullshit. So I, I stopped talking to you because I wanted to fuck you and you didn't want to fuck me. Are no, you not? I didn't say that. I said you fell out with me because you didn't like the way I spoke about not wanting to sleep with you. No, That's... I don't believe it was that. Go and watch it, it's on YouTube. <laughs> It's got like thousands of views. Uh, look, what's happened in the past will happen in the past. Let's not act like it's just me. Okay, you let's talk about what you want said. want sex. Not from you. I want to fuck oh. Sinead. I want to fuck Chioma. I might fuck Tiddy if it was, but you know, but no, I well, don't. you're never going to get it. That's fine, and you're never going to get this. Well, I really and truly, I want to <laughs> fuck the big guy. So not go you. and get that. But yours, you know, last, last choice. You got to do what you got to do. All right, let me tell you something, yeah? In life, and I'm sure you've experienced this, you have options and you don't have to take the, the worst options. The options are limited right now. And that's Very fine. Limited. And you know sometimes when the options are limited, just take your shit and take your offer elsewhere. You know, like you said, you've only got five days or a few odd days left. When you get back to town, you got a dick waiting on you. In fact, let the dick come and pick you up from the airport. On the airport, airport I've that, got dick in waiting. Fact, let the dick be on the tarmac going guiding the plane <laughs> with me. <laughs> Anyway, I don't think, personally, I don't think you'll be a good beat, let's be honest. Then why do you want to fuck me, my I guy? I don't. I never wanted to fuck you. I wanted to cuddle and hug and be, you know... Uh, Intimate. Y yeah, but without and the get sex. Affection. I didn't really want to have sex, let's be honest. You, so you wanted affection yeah. from me? love. And you might have got that, but you went about it the wrong way. Let's, let's, let's stop fucking about it anyway. Nunu, when we see each other, we don't even hug each other. So how do we go from not yeah, even we, hugging each other? One, not, this uh, is the nearest proximity you've spent and the longest conversation we've had. Because you keep avoiding me. In my opinion, I don't think the sex will be good between us. You don't even feel no energy between me. You just are roasting. I don't feel like we would have good chemistry in bed. And if we had bad energy... We in could, potentially we could. I'm telling you, my sister, it's, it's not... We, we don't have that thing there. We don't okay. have that... Mm, you get me? We will die. One of us will kill the other person. And I don't want to... There's a cliff. I, mean, I don't want to fuck. Can we just hug? Can we just hold hands? Can we just flip in... Huh? You want to hold my hand? <laughs> <laughs> Mark has big hands. He's nice, big. Like you said, that was that was your prime, prime guy. He would have been number one. He's, he's still is... there, though. No. You his can hold his. Heart is cold. You, are you think my heart is warm? Oh, that's just so yeah. sweet. Nunu said um, I was her last choice, but she's been giving me first choice attention for the past couple of days. And I wasn't her first choice, to be fair. I know she was on to Mark, but she <laughs> Mark shut that shit down too. So. Seems like you're all out of options, baby girl. On to the next. After a whirlwind of ups and downs, the shopping finally arrives. Now order could be restored in the villa once again. Are you 